Hello, and thank you for tuning into this channel again today. Um, today, I'm going to just show some of my guitars because it is negative one out right now, and the RV is pretty much snowed in, and uh, so is the uh, trailer, so there's not much work I can do. So, I'm um, just going to show you some of the, the guitars uh, that I use, um, and I hope you guys like it. Thanks. <laughs> Schechter. This is a, uh, a B24. Um, as you can see, this has the pinup grill on it. I don't know if you guys can see that pretty decent. Um, not a common guitar. This guitar here um, got a really good deal on it. Um, it's got the USAF. Now you guys who have uh, been in the service, um, you get a kick out of this. You see the inlays all the way up and down. Um, so this guitar is pretty cool, um, American made, and I absolutely love it. It's definitely one of my favorite guitars. Pretty much do anything um, that I want to with it, and uh, it's got some really cool uh, tones to it. <laughs> Mexican Strat. I got this one at a uh, pawn shop. Um, and I don't know if you can see what I got written on here. I put stickers on things. So uh, I always try to have something good, a good message written so when people can see me play, they can actually, you know, just be encouraged by just seeing me play, not what I'm actually playing. <laughs> G400. You can see it's got the three pickups, the three humbuckers in it, which is pretty cool. This is uh, the Epiphone's uh, version, high-end version of the SG. This guitar is pretty cool. I use this a lot for my rhythm stuff. Very beautiful guitar. <laughs> sound to it and uh, definitely is uh, a player for me.
This guitar is a K Divinity mm -hmm. Series. This is an ES uh, 175 style body. Um, this uh, guitar has quite a bit of history for me. This is uh, one of my dad's guitars, and he passed away. And I was able to, to get this one as a gift. Um, and uh, sure, as a country guitarist, he probably uh, rolls over in his grave quite a bit with the stuff I play on this thing. But uh, again, I do all styles. So uh, whatever the mood strikes me, I have a guitar for it. But this is a K. Um, I also have another K. This one here, um, this is pretty cool. This is an ES-335 style. Um, obviously, I'm a fan of K's. Um, so, uh, yeah, that's uh, the beginning of my K collection. All-time favorite guitar out of anything that I own. Uh, this is a 1983 Gibson SG. <laughs> some point on this guitar a lot of history uh, in it uh, for me and a lot of history actually in the guitar itself not gonna find another one like this uh, anywhere I've been looking for almost well about over 20 years I've been looking for this for another one like this definitely my favorite guitar uh, my mom got this for me um, through a trade of an old uh, Fender amp uh, Fender Deluxe 1952 or 1953 Tweed Deluxe yeah. But, uh, which you guys don't know what that is, it's extremely hard to find, extremely, extremely rare uh, amp. And uh, this guitar has been literally incredible to me. Um, it's just, out of anything that I have, this is the most uh, precious possession that I own. And it's gotten me through more stuff than you possibly can believe about, which is why it's going to end up being a video of, uh, of itself sometime. But again, this is an 83 Gibson SG Special. Um, it's not green. It's a faded metallic silver, um, so uh, it's pretty all, much all original, and it's been played all over the place. which was a band I was in doing guitar and uh, I, uh, I don't know, I've been playing bass for years I make a uh, decent living at it um, and uh, one of the reasons going going up to Denver is to uh, you know look for jobs with music obviously and bass is a pretty easy instrument for me so <laughs> Thank you. 
uh, Washburn fretless. This has uh, active electronics in it, um, which is pretty cool. All my basses have active electronics. Um, this is a four string uh, fretless, pretty nice bass. Um, and you do a lot of things with these on it and get some really cool sounds. This is a Schechter eight string bass. And I'll introduce this one before I play it because it's just really freaking cool. And uh, it's definitely a, uh, a big instrument. Um, it's kind of set up like a 12 string with the uh, lower octave uh, and the higher octave together. Um, or lower pitch, higher pitch, however you want to, you know, however much you know about music. Um, but it's kind of a 12 string guitar. You're hitting two notes at once. Um, and it, I don't know. I'm just going to play it. It's pretty cool. Thank <laughs> you.